Welcome to my channel. Today I want to show you how you can use the third person animation in your first person chapter. But everybody know if you go to third person uh, the blueprint, you open the chapter, uh, viewport. So if you select the mesh, you want to change the animal class. No, 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 you want mess per the hands. If you I change it for the third person animation, you can see it's not working right. Because it's not retarget now yet. So we change this back where they go like that. So we go to here, content. We need to go to the skeleton of the third person animations have it. So mannequin character go to mesh go ahead. Unreal Engine for Skeleton. So open it. Right here, you have to go to Retarget Manager. If you don't have it in the top here, you can find it right here. They're gonna say Retarget Manager. It's the same thing. So when you ask, when when you are here, you can select rig, and select Human or rig. Uh, here, you're gonna be Auto Map. So here, you're gonna Skeleton Tree again. So here the option, you click it, you show retargeting the option. You click it too. So now here in root, you can use the right button. You select recursive set transition retargeting skeleton. You press it. everything you have to be a skeleton. So save it. Now we have to go to the skeleton or the third person skeleton. So we have to go back to content, third person, characters, mesh, uh, mannequin arms, open it. If we have to do the same thing. So go to retarget manager, select rig, select woman or rig, auto map, go to skeleton tree again, options, show retargeting option. It's saying here root, you go to the right button, retarget set transition, and everything is skeleton again. So save it. Now we have the same skeleton. So now we can go to to animation so go content go to we have the animation gonna be mannequin animation or whatever you have it so I want to use the idle so I'm gonna press idle to the right button too so here you go on the top is the retarget animate asset go to duplicate animate asset and retarget so here you have the third person character we need to select the the other character so we have both of them here so they go to retarget so now we have it here so if we open it they want to be perfect for the first person shooter now what have why the problem now if we close these ones we go to uh to the character animation blueprint they go animation blueprint so if i choose the arrow so the new I create, so I put it here, the video I don't need anymore. If I connect it, we're supposed to work fine, but it is it doesn't. So right here they could say it's different rotation. So if we, we save it and play it, we can see it's not right. So we have to exit again. So here you wanna call it some change here. So we need to here place third person idle, the new one. We're gonna call the somewhere called local to component. So from local to component, we go to transform modify bar right here. So in here you need to connect in the other way. So you want to make component to local. So component to local. You have it here to connect with the output right here. So complete and save. Now we're asking what you have to transform or modify. Modify. So you click it. You want to set bone to modify. So select root. So right here we need to change the translation and rotation. This case is right. So we have to translation, we can ignore, we're gonna change it to add to system. 
the same thing with rotation. We're going to ignore, go to add to system, and save it. So now we we want to change the rotation. They're going to be like minus 90. So click it. Right now it's a facing the same way. So compile, save. Now if we play, we can see we have now is the right direction, but it's too close to the camera. So we need to adjust some values here. So in translation, we can move X, Y, or Z. So we have to change, like for me, my favorite is going to be minus 25. And here it's going to be minus 10. So we save it. We have it right here. Now it's perfect. So I can see it because it's a fair person, but I can go to Blueprint again, open the Blueprints uh, character, we can see here, right here. Now the animation is, is in the same position I want it. Now if I want to walk to, because right now they have the other one, so if I move <laughs> the original one, so I go back again, content again, Go to animation I wanted, go to the run, right click, you're gonna get retarget animation asset, duplicate animation asset and retarget, choose the skeleton you want, retarget, that's it. So now I want to change this one to the blueprint, so go again, per person, animation, blueprints, copy all these, you know, I don't want to do it again, so copy. Now go to new state machine, go run, delete this, you don't need anymore. Go to run and paste it here. So now you have connect this local to component, component to local to output. Whoops, to right like that. So compile and save. Now they're supposed to work perfectly fine. Go to run walk perfectly you have the animation of the third person shoot it so i hope you like it if you, and you learn something new so if you like the video you want to support me so you can subscribe to my channel and support my patreon page so thank you bye bye